My name is Mike Lisi here with Jonathan Feliciano. All right, he didn't have flat shoes on today, so I made him take his shoes off. You want a flat base when you're deadlifting. Okay, so the first thing we're going to go over is set the stance. All right, so I'm going to have John just give me uh, give me three, uh, three to five jumps in the air. Just jump three to five times. We'll go five times. Two, three, four, last one. Good. Where his feet are right now is pretty much where a deadlift stance will be. You know, we'll adjust it accordingly, but that's pretty much where I want him to be. All right, so remember that stance. That's going to be your stance to be deadlift, all right? So from here, you're going to walk into the bar, all right, about one to two inches away from the bar, okay? The major thing with the deadlift is the hip pinch down to the bar, okay? So the squat is a slight hip pinch, all right? But now I'm going to go full hip pinch down to the bar, right here, all the way until I reach the bar. Good. Now with my elbows. Tight to my knees, right here, okay? I'm driving up my whole foot, okay? I'm gonna pull a slack out of the bar, but before I do that, I wanna get a deep belly breath, okay? And then I pull the slack out of the bar. So you hear it click. If it's 135 pounds in the bar, I want 134 pounds in your hand before you start to lift. Okay, so everything's tight back here, okay? Across the scapula, like the rhomboids, whatever needs to be tight, relax, okay? So, I'm going to walk into the bar one more time, one to two inches away. All right, I'm going to hip hinge down. Now, the next thing I'm going to mention is my chin tuck. I want my head up like this. I want a neutral position for my, my, my lower back and my spine and my head. All in a, in a straight rod. In a straight rod. Okay, so I'm going to hip hinge down. Get that chin tuck. Deep belly breath. I'm going to hip pinch my way back to the floor. I want to push the floor away from me when I'm, when I'm, when I'm going up with the bar, but I want to push the floor away from me. I just try to step in. One, two inches away from the bar. Good. Now we're going to hip pinch down to the bar. Double overhand grip. Deep belly breath. Pull slack out of the bar. Good. Good. Be careful not to overextend the hips. You overextend the hips just a little bit of this, this, this rep, okay? You don't want to be have the hips too far forward, all right? Anterior pelvic tilt, okay? You want to be right here neutral, all right? You don't put too much stress on the hip flexors, okay? So, if you get one more rep, hip pitch it back down. Go pull a slack. Good. Now extend, uh, lift. Good. It's a little bit better. You want to work on that, on that hip, not going too far forward, okay? Drop it back down. The last thing I want to go over is when the bar passes the knee level, or the kneecap level, that's why I want that lockout position. And lockout position, I mean right here, and boom, extended right here, okay? Flexing the quads, flexing the glutes. Right here, snap it. Right here, snap it. Okay, right here. Snap your hips right into the bar, but not overextending, like I just said. Just snap your hips right into the bar, all the way from the top. Good. That's it, double overhand grip. Pull the slack out, deep belly breath. Good. Good, that was a really good snap by John. That's a deadlift.